What's up y'all, this is Kate Tater Tot, and today I'll be giving y'all a life lesson. Alright y'all, so this one is going to be about being independent. Alright, so um, being independent is the most major thing you can do for yourself. Alright, you know, when, if you're an adult, you should be independent. Like, for the most part, you shouldn't have to depend on another person, you know, for most situations. Alright, so, the steps to being independent will be first, is to accept yourself. And what I mean by that is, accept who you are and what you can and can't do. You have to know yourself, alright? You need to know what you can do because if you're trying to do something you can't do, then it's not going to get done. All right, so accept yourself, and then you can build on that. You can make yourself better in things that you're weak in, and you can just reinforce what you're already good at. All right. <sighs> Next, believe in yourself. What I mean by that is. Have faith in your choices that you're making the right choice. Because a lot of people always second guess stuff or I should did this, should did that. You know, if you make a choice, you can stick with it. You know, good or bad, you made a bad choice, you know, accept the consequences of it, and learn from it. All right? So believe that you're going to do what's best for yourself. All right? Next, um, accept that. Life isn't fair. Simple as that. So, when unfortunate circumstances happen, <clears throat> you know, we're all human. So, I give you some situations, you know, get a little leeway, maybe let it hit you for a few minutes, complain about it, but then get right back on the horse and just, all right, so I got this bad situation. I am going to keep pushing through it and do the best I can. Alright? Sometimes life just un it's just unfair. Some stuff is just unfair. Because life is fair, we will all have the same living standards. We will all have the same intelligence. We will all have the same amount of money. You know, so accept it, move on, and overcome the situation. Alright? That's why I try to tell a lot of people that. Like, don't focus on the unfairness of the situation that you're in. Don't focus on the bad part of that situation. You know what's happening. Complain about it ain't going to help. Do something about it. All right? All right, next. Um, be your own hero. What I mean by that is save yourself sometimes, you know? Um, don't depend on others to save you when you need them. Because sometimes people might not be available. Other outside sources might not be available. You have to save yourself. And that goes with the whole believing in yourself. Alright? You can get yourself out of this situation. Always think that. Sometimes, you know, you can't. Let's be real. This is real life. Sometimes you can't. But most of the time, you have to know that you can get yourself out of a situation. So... Save yourself. Next, um, be self motivated. All right, because you know, who's if you can't get an outside source of motivation, you know, are you just gonna not do what you have to do? You have to learn how to self motivate. Uh, I learned that one in like 19. Had to motivate yourself to succeed. Because sometimes you might get everybody in the world telling you, you can't do it. Don't do it. It's impossible. You know, everything knocking you down. You're, you're failing in all your attempts. But you got to learn how to self-motivate and get yourself back together and get out and do what you need to do. All right. Now, let's see. Some techniques. Um, personally, mine is just, you know... One of mine is, I think, what if my nephew saw me doing 
what I'm doing now. Like he saw me failing and I preach to him all the time. Hey, believe in yourself, do what you gotta do. And he saw me being down and out and not trying to succeed in what I'm doing. So that's what motivates me because I don't want him to see that. So I'm gonna live by what I say. All right? All right, so next. Uh, stop caring what other, what other people think, all right? So a lot of people, they make a lot of major decisions based off of what other people might think. Uh, like some people decide to be a doctor just because that's a big field to be in. And, you know, people always probably told them, oh, you should be a doctor or a lawyer. Forget about that. Do what you want to do. Do what you feel is right for you. Do what you love to do. All right. So, what people think, it really won't matter. Your happiness is what matters. Why would you be successful and not be happy? To me, doing what you love or picking something that you love, that's, that's having success. Because you love your job, you love what you're doing, and you love the decision that you made, even though some people might think it's a bad decision. Guess what? It's not their life. All right, so don't worry about what other people think. So last thing is uh, get your own information, all right? Part of being independent is being able to survive on your own. And so you need to go out, get your own information, um, I really don't too much like to go by word of mouth. So if people tell me stuff, I actually look it up or research it and see, you know, because they can be wrong. It, it's not always what I'm trying to say is um, like somebody tell you, oh, you know, this, this rule is being applied now. Okay. You look that shit up and see if it's real. And somebody like going out and get your own information, you can make a better educated educated choice, all right? Because like right now, I'm looking for my next house. You know what I did? I got on the internet and I did all my research. And I looked up all the apartments and houses. I didn't post nothing on Facebook and be like, oh, can anybody tell me where, you know, the best neighborhood is that because somebody gonna tell you only what they know what they know that's it don't do I hate when people do that especially with little small stuff like oh what are these store hours the time you took to type that into Facebook you could literally Google that that's been that's to me that's in, to me that's a extreme case of being dependent you can't even look up store hours come on all right so that's the last thing that's all i got if you live by these rules you should be independent all right so if you disagree or you know if you do agree leave a comment if you like the video like it click the like button make sure y'all share it and also go to my youtube channel just search k tater time and subscribe to it all right, see y'all.